Hello lovelies, welcome to my channel. This is Leanne from Resin Shine Creations and I hope you are all doing well. In today's video I have a 30 cm large round MDF board and today I'll be creating resin ocean art but this time uh, and it's the first time for me the beach area I'll be making modeling out of modeling paste so here I already started by placing it on the board on my beach side and going in with my tools I will create the look that I was imagining to have and this time I imagine my beach having being a little bit uh, on the rugged side so I'll see how it's gonna pan out and also I just was trying to add a little depth into my uh, sea so I kind of created these uh, little holes and later I'm gonna paint them a bit darker so this is the first layer dry and I decided to bit uh, go over and create second layer and once it's done I'm gonna let it again to get dry and then I'll be adding a little bit of sand just to add a little bit of texture extra extra texture And now on to the next step it's painting for this step I just use regular acrylic colors and yeah just paint 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 And this now is absolute my favorite step is to paint the seabed with blues and greens. Oh, I just adore blues and greens. So 
Also, it kind of represents that uh, this is the last step before applying a resin. So this is the part where things start to come together. And now it's time to pour the resin. So this is the first layer and I discover a little trick that it would work better for me. Instead of making dirty three pots, I can just start with my transparent and then add color in the same pot and then again keep adding color in the same pot. So this resin that I'm using is very, very thick one. It is Art Pro Deluxe and it's kind of still new to me. I'm still learning to work with it, but I enjoy thick resin. It does have quite few bubbles after pouring it, but I usually tend to just leave them for about 20 minutes and they all disappear or become really um, very little and then just go over with the blowtorch and then they just gonna pop away. So this was my first layer. I'm gonna let it cure and then again gonna come in and make layers, couple layers with also white waves.
So this right now is my last layer. Uh, I think, I feel that this last layer always is the most important. It's make or break layer. So I was trying to go like the way it was overlapping with more curve than usual. And not gonna lie, sometimes you just have days where the things don't come as you wish they would come out. So I think this was one of those times when you just pour down the resin and you straight feel it that it's not gonna work out for you. So here is my overlapping white going in and then again I just gonna blow it out. And I felt also that blowing wasn't really working out for me on this layer. But in the end I got there. And here it is, the finished result. I do like how the white came out. The cells look really amazing. And overall making a uh, beach with modeling paste was a success as well. So if you found this video useful and entertaining, please let me know by leaving comment down below. But for now I'm saying goodbye, keep creating, bye!